exciting was it to get this first win after so many like losing? Oh uh, yeah, feel good, you know, to get back on the on the winning side. But things, you know, just got to keep pushing, and you know, we on the Rutgers. <laughs> You guys were really flying around on defense today. Is that something that you stressed in practice? Uh, that's just that's just part of our defense. That's just some coach out of stresses. That's just something we stresses as players. You know, and, uh, we challenge each other. You know, I challenge Chase Deuce to this game. Also, you know, I told him I was gonna play harder than him this game. You know, Chase Deuce is a guy that you know flies around all the time. You know, you see him everywhere on the field making plays. So, you know, just seeing him do those things, you know, it, it affects me. And I told him this game I was gonna I was gonna play harder than you. I'm gonna play fast than you. But yeah, that's that's something in the defensive culture that we um that we pride ourselves on was playing hard, playing fast, and you know, you sitting today. And did you guys do that weekly, challenge each other, or was this kind of a new thing for just this game? Uh I, I, I this is really new for this game, you know. Uh, Chase has been making plays, you know, he uh he likes to talk about the stats, you know, in the in the book, you know. So I, I, I challenged him this game, so you know, it's fun out there, you know. What what did he say back when you when you challenged him? Oh yeah, he was all for it. You know, he all in. You know, and uh, he was talking to, talking me to the game. He was talking uh, to me in the game, like you know, what you gonna do? Where, where you at? I ain't heard your name. You know, things things in that nature. So you know, he's a uh, fun guy to compete with. You know, he's my brother, and I love. Him. To have three um, takeaways in the fourth quarter, just talk about what that did for the team and kind of uh, securing the win. Oh, uh, it's crucial. You know, we we um, you know turnovers, takeaways. I'm sorry. Win the game, you know. Obviously, yeah, we was on a uh, plus side of the, out of the margin today, and we came out with a victory. What were the big keys to doing two things: getting the takeaways and then getting the string of three and outs that the, the coach Allen also emphasizes? Uh, I, I mean, it's the key of the game, you know. You get, you get takeaways, you know. It, it's it's a momentum change. It's a big shift in the game. So, you know, we, we stress ourselves on getting takeaways, and um, you know, we work it all the time in practice. And um, today we came out with three. And um, the results were on our side. And, 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 the, and the three and outs, what was, what was kind of key to putting those together throughout the course of the game? Uh, just winning first down, you know, stopping on first downs, two yards or less maybe on first downs. And, you know, that's what, something that we pride ourselves on doing is winning first down. Talk about the takeaways. How happy were you to see two of your senior teammates in Richard and T. Gray come up with interceptions? Oh, it's, it's exciting, you know. And, um, you know, everybody wants one every week. You know, I wanted one this week. Unfortunately, it went to T. Gray, you know. And, and it's exciting, you know. To get takeaways on the defense side of the ball, you know we, we normally want to score on defense. You know possibly points off the takeaways, or you know we take it in ourselves for six. But you know to get those takeaways is crucial in the game.